Good morning. Well, today I'm just going to do a summary, day 27. <clears throat> Pretty much what we've been through, and the feedback's been great. Um, if you have any questions, just send them to me. I'd love to answer them. But um, we've gone over putting, speed, most important. Chipping, use the bounce. Bunker play, take out a $5 bill. The wedge matrix, left arm becomes a clock. How speed is important to play golf at the highest level. Um, we talked about positions in the swing and then risk conditions. And then what are the fundamentals of golf? The fundamentals aren't um, grip, stance, posture, holding lag, creating lag. Fundamentals are things like controlling where the club hits the ground, having speed to be able to shoot a certain score, and then being able to control the curve. Um, so I'll still carry on because we have another seven days. So I will still be doing videos each day. I've now moved back into my apartment hoping we can get back on track so um, here's a couple of things I just found for the line around my apartment that was when I won the national championship with Oklahoma so that was a gold plate of putter that was actually the brand of putter and the style of putter I used here was the actual national championship and we all got one of these I used to love wearing it but then when I came back to New Zealand you can imagine what they were calling me and then I had a party once in the States, and a guy came and brought over a thing of spates. And then on the back, there was a bit of trivia. And there it was, who won the New Zealand Open in 1998. Anyway, I will continue videos tomorrow, moving forward, so we can all keep learning. And I'm just making you think. That's all it is. We all have theories. There's all great theories out there, but I'm just making you think making you understand what you're doing, and then when you have a purpose, when you practice, so you can get better at golf. But I'm just going to finish. I listened to this on a podcast the other day. This was a famous coach, and this is what his thought was on COVID-19. And he said, so many people are suffering right now, and it's given us time to reflect. And the problem with people is we're always busy. We're always busy. And when we finally get to slow down, our minds become noisy. And this was the finishing thing that I think is great. I'm going to read the final note, and then I'll see you guys tomorrow with some more information. In closing with COVID-19, he said, We stay busy to run from the failure of paying attention to our own personal truths. See you tomorrow.